So today we have a structure to function workshop going on with, with uh, science teachers and ag teachers from across the state. We have about 22 uh, registered teachers. They're going to get about eight hours of in-service training strictly on agriculture and how to integrate lessons, ideals for them to take back to their classrooms to further the knowledge of their students when it comes to teaching agriculture and where their food comes from. Teachers have to continue to update their methods to continue to grow with the times. Things are changing, more technology. Uh, if you're gonna keep the kids interested, you've gotta be teaching things that they know, that they understand. Uh, learning about things like drones, aeroponics, hydroponics, things like that that are relevant today that they understand, that they're interested in. That keeps their attention, that makes them invest in those programs and those uh, values that you're trying to teach them. Once you get them bought in, they're all in. So these trainings are important to keep us at the forefront of technology. We're training our students for the next generation and in order for us to do that and be effective at it, we have to stay at the forefront ourselves. So these trainings are instrumental in the classroom. Today's been fabulous. I have learned a wealth of information, um, things that I never knew, little tidbits to take back to class and um, to keep the kids involved and to keep them interested. Some great experiments that we can do um, and of course the extras that we get to take home are always an added benefit. We wouldn't be able to do these types of workshops without the generous support of our, our commodity groups that help us, the Arkansas Corn and Grain Sorghum Board, the Soybean Promotion Board, and the Arkansas Farm Bureau Foundation.